I know I'm getting older, but my art is not getting older. I just do what I want to when I can, and I feel that my art is continuing to improve all the time. I've been so-called making art since I was a little girl. I always drew, and then when I went to school, I had classes in watercolor and oil. What inspired me to create is I, I enjoy seeing things and I like to do things in a different way. So I try to create in my own way a subject that I like. And during the night, sometimes I see something or feel something and I wake up and I write it down and then it's like a little story and I create a story and a painting. We're always looking for new ways to serve and care for our residents. One initiative in senior housing today is the movement of retirement communities from the traditional clinical model to one that is more person-directed care. And what that means simply is that we want to make it more of a home-like environment for our residents. We don't want to take that away from them. We want to give them choices based on their preferences on how we care and serve them. I think that the AVHOW Advantage is really our answer to that. One of our greatest strengths is that we deliver extraordinary quality of care and we're known as elite in our industry for that. And we're going to take the same focus that has enabled us to reach that kind of a status and we're going to refocus that on further developing our ability to deliver great hospitality and we want to be more than great, we want to be extraordinary. The Avhow Advantage is our culture. It's a hospitality culture that allows us to create an environment where we can provide that extraordinary service to our residents. It's a set of behaviors and commitments and an attitude, and it's all based off of our pillars of service. What I love most about Pacific Meadows, of course, is that it is affordable. Actually, the income I have, I could not even get a single bedroom apartment here in Carmel for my entire income. So to be able to afford to live here in this beautiful place is awesome as far as I'm concerned. There are no two days alike at all. I just love my freedom to choose what am I going to do today. I can go for a walk. Uh, I can hang out with friends. I always feel secure here because there's such a uh, wonderful uh, camaraderie or amount of teamwork that happens here. And it's like, I just need to go to the front desk or make even just a phone call if I don't want to go out of my apartment and tell what is needed. And as quickly as possible, uh, maintenance in my apartment is handled. I keep coming back to that, the peace of mind we have by living here. I know that, that my needs, urgent needs, are going to be met quickly and, and with a lot of care and with just a lot of fun and, and companionship. ABHO goes above and beyond what's expected by, first of all, hiring the right people. We look for team members who have a heart for our mission. And once we've been able to identify that, we know that it's innate in them. It's almost a special calling that they have. And so then we, we train them to be able to recognize and anticipate uh, the needs, the expressed wishes and the unexpressed wishes of our residents and guests. And we empower them to meet those needs. My job empowers me to implementing uh, exercise programs for those residents who are disabled, who uh, need work on their balance. It's great waking up in the morning. It's not a job, it's a passion. That I, I like to be here, I want to be here. Every day a, a resident uh, changes my life in, in, in different ways. It inspires me, it inspires me to, to sing what they can do at the age of 80, 90, or even 100, and uh, that gives me the drive uh, to look towards the future, and uh, there's no limitations in, 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 in life. There is such a high energy with our team members over the Abhow Advantage, and it's created such an excitement. You can really feel that buzz in the air and that energy. Our team members are looking for ways to uh, provide that extraordinary over-the-top service for our residents and when they're not quite doing that they're actually giving permissions to each other to allow them to hold each other accountable. 
I think that Abhau moving to a hospitality culture is very important simply because our demographics of our customer is changing and we need to be getting ready for that next generation of resident that will be moving into our community. Service, good service, is just status quo now. It's not good enough. If you have a bad experience, you tell people about that bad experience and you share it. If you receive good service, that's what's expected today. But if you have extraordinary service, and that's what we're striving to do here in our communities, you're going to share that with somebody. And hopefully that's going to drive an interest for people to come see our community and want to experience that too for their retirement. I feel that team members provide extraordinary service in the fact that they work together and they enjoy working here. It's very evident. They're always smiling, very happy. One area of the team that we find most uh, helpful is the activity staff. They have given us so much to do and so many things that we need, plus lots of ways to occupy our time. We lived in our house for 16 years and we have availed ourselves to so many activities. In six months our living here, we've done more socially than we did 16 years living in our home. Living here, I am very inspired with my art. Every place I walk, I see beautiful flowers. I see people walking and they're so happy looking. And that gives me a feeling of, of belonging. It took me five years to move here, but when I did, I was so glad. And I will be glad forever because I enjoy living here. I love my apartment and I like all the people that are here. They enjoy my art and I enjoy theirs. I think everybody's creative in their own way. After all of our team members were trained in the Ab How Advantage, you'd notice around campus that everybody was using different language to describe how they were feeling that day. For instance, how are you? I'm extraordinary. And that really comes from our motto, which is we're extraordinary professionals serving extraordinary people. Here you go, sir. Thank you so much. I am extraordinary. We are extraordinary. I am extraordinary. I am extraordinary. Believe it or not. <laughs> <laughs>